YouTube Shopping Affiliate Program lets you easily tag products from a variety of brands and retailers, giving viewers a seamless shopping experience and letting you earn commission when they purchase products from your content. In this video, we'll walk through how the program works, eligibility requirements, how to tag products, and how to track your earnings progress. Let's dive in. When you tag products in your videos, shorts, or live streams, a shopping button will show on your content. Viewers can browse the products that you featured without leaving the watch page. When viewers click on a product, they'll be redirected to the merchant's site. If a purchase is made from your link, you'll earn commission on the viewer's entire purchase. To be eligible for the YouTube Shopping Affiliate Program, your channel must meet the subscriber threshold and be approved for monetization. You also can't have a channel that's made for kids or a music or official artist channel. And you can't have community guideline strikes in certain sensitive policy areas. Note that affiliate product tags also won't show on videos that contain claimed content. Let's walk through how to tag your products in your videos and shorts. You can tag products during the upload flow by going to Tag Products. From here, you can click the drop-down to see stores available from different sellers. Or you can search for the brand or product that you want to tag. Next to each product, you'll see the total product price and the commission rate that you would receive for that product, which is always a percentage of the total price. This commission rate listed is 100% of what you will earn. Commission rates will vary by product and merchant. Once you find the products you want, you can tag them. You can tag up to 30 products. To remove a product, click the trash icon next to the product. Note that if you're uploading a video and you included links while drafting your description, you may see them suggested for tagging. You can also tag products in existing videos and shorts. To do this, go to the Content tab in Studio, then select the piece of content you want. From the Details page, go to Products. You can also tag products in your live streams and feature a tagged product by pinning it to the stream. Viewers can see tagged products by tapping the shop icon and can shop without leaving your stream. You can tag products from your phone during the setup for a mobile live stream. To tag products for your live stream from a desktop, go to Live Control Room. In the left menu, select Stream or Manage. Below the live stream preview, click the Shopping tab. Then click the plus icon to search and select products. You can tag up to 30 products. To remove a product, click Trash next to the product. You can also pin one item during your live stream to feature it prominently. For a mobile live stream, you can tap the shopping button, then pin the product you want to feature. For a desktop stream, from Live Control Room, click the Shopping tab. Select one item to promote. Click or drag it to the Preview panel, then click Pin Product. Your pinned product will be prominently featured during your stream. Viewers can click on the Shopping button to see more details and options to purchase the product. Now let's talk about a few things to keep in mind when it comes to commissions. You'll earn commission on the entire basket size. So if a viewer clicks on your product tag and ends up buying other items, you'll receive commissions for everything they purchased during that transaction. You'll receive payment through your AdSense account, typically 60 to 120 days after purchase, to account for returns and timing of AdSense payment. If a viewer returns an item they purchased, the commissions you earn will be reversed. Some brands offer different conversion windows. For example, you can earn commissions for up to 30 days after a viewer clicks on your tagged product, as long as that viewer didn't click on someone else's affiliate link or product tag. Note, you'll only be paid commissions from the YouTube affiliate program if viewers click from affiliate products tagged in your content. Next, here are some things to keep in mind and best practices when tagging products. Only tag products if they're easily identifiable and featured prominently, or if they're meaningfully related to your content. And only tag if the products are used as intended, or you're using the product in a safe way that aligns with the manufacturer's intent. When making new videos, remember to direct your viewers to view your tagged products. And consider tagging products in both new and existing videos, especially your most popular ones. Also note that you may still be able to go through the flow of tagging products, even if they won't show to viewers in cases where your content is made for kids, contains claimed content, or other restrictions. So be sure to familiarize yourself with these restrictions ahead of time. Finally, let's walk through how to track your earnings. You can find earnings data by going to YouTube Studio Analytics, then Revenue, 
then the affiliate chip. Here, you'll see channel-level data, including estimated revenue, product clicks, number of orders, and total sales. You'll also see top earning products and top earning content. You can also find info by going to the Studio Earn page, then the Shopping tab. The YouTube Shopping Affiliate Program is a great way to earn more money by recommending the products you love and helps create a seamless shopping experience for your viewers. For more info, check out the links in the description below. Thanks for watching.